Wait. Oh my god. Will you be my Valentine? Who ah! gave you this? Oh, it was on the door, but you can have it. <laughs> Woo! Mommy's here! Hola, como esta? It's happy. Jonathan, Alma, Mami, hola. Hola, partiendo jicama. Ah, ok. Mmm, delicioso. Con tapatillo. Ah, ok. Ok, hey guys, welcome to our kitchen. Ta-da! No, but today we are gonna be doing a video. Jonathan and I went um kind of plant-based i would say it's like a pescatarian slash vegetarian lifestyle right um, well, hold the thought here the heck's going on over here Jeez, okay <laughs> there we have dogs just uh -huh. playing <laughs> guys so we have been eating like this for about a month i would say yeah like about a month and we wanted to show you guys kind of our new way of eating and what we have been eating so, so what's on the menu tonight, we went honey? to trader joe's sunday and we kind of stuffed up a little bit so here are a few things that we get we get aloe vera we get coconut juice we get almond milk that's my mom's um this is uh spinach tortellini we got cucumbers we do get cheese because, like I said, we are vegetarian. Um, we get these wraps from Trader Joe's, like veggie wraps, hummus wraps. They have a color green wrap. So we get these. Um, so basically, we just stock up on veggies. We have this spinach, bell peppers, mushrooms, blueberries. We had grapefruit too. Yeah, there's like brown rice sauté kit, tofu. Beefless beef. Well, what are we having tonight? We're gonna have um, beefless beef um, stuffed bell peppers. Take a look, guys. Oh, just like on the package. Perfect. Yeah. So we're gonna have those tonight. I'm gonna make, I like to make about, I would say quite a few of them. Um, we have five. Jonathan sometimes eats two and then the rest we have for lunch and stuff. Um, zoom, zoom, so bye. I also, <laughs> I also got this kombucha and I'm actually going to try it right I now. I thought that was mine. You got one too. Oh, I did. This fridge sucks. Right here. You Every turn, time you like you you leave the, the fridge, yeah, you, you leave the fridge open and it keeps the like fridge. crazy. Every time you leave the fridge open. The fridge. Oh, and this is cool guys. So if you don't know, Trader Joe's has a lot of vegetarian and vegan options for like frozen foods. Oh yeah, what did we get? Um, we like to be quick. So we got sweet potato fries. They have vegan tiki masala. Mm. I'm dying to try yeah. this. Um, we get gluten-free mac, mac and cheese, brown rice, potatoes. Oh, these are really good. They're sweet chili veggie burgers. Chana masala. Chana masala. <laughs> Vegetable biryani. Biria. Don't, don't come at me on the comments for that. Biria. We get garlic naan. And then with right. this, we have frozen fruit. So yeah, that's kind of what we get. All right, let's get it going. Bell pepper, beefless. Uh, yeah, so the way I make pepper. it. Yeah, let's see how you make it. My um, wife's best cook, by the way. I feel like I haven't been into the vlog today. No. Hey guys, it's I'm just here. Me without makeup, looking rough. <laughs> <laughs> the camera is kind of hard to hold, but um, Steffi's cooking tonight. I'm filming, and uh, she's doing a good job. Oh. She, this is like her meal, so my hands are off tonight. And then we get these two that I didn't, I forgot to mention, but these are really good. This is like a vegetarian chili, and it's actually oh. bomb. With this, with the uh, mac and cheese, it's so good. That's how we make oh. it. And then a lentil soup. I love lentil soup, so that, oh. I get that. And I think I'm gonna make sweet potato fries. That's gonna be my specialty tonight. Uh, put it, pop it in the oven, 450, 25 minutes. Boom, done. Put a little Montreal steak seasoning. Check this out. This is like my favorite Montreal steak seasoning. Um, even though I never put it on steak, we don't eat steak anymore, really. 
but it's really good, delicious. I'll have it on eggs, everything, everything. Just water too. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So I'm gonna wash these. Okay. If you guys were curious, so I'm gonna wash these first, and then let them know how you've been feeling with this new diet. Like, what's what's different? Like, has it worked out for you? Like, what? I'm on the toilet like 24/7, but it's great. How I'm do you kidding. feel? <laughs> how do you feel? Um. Let has me it, check. Hold has on. it been hard? <gasps> Oi! Has it been hard to? So let me tell you guys. Uh, I feel great. I feel high energy. Like, yeah, my cat too. She's not very Aiden. Um, Aiden, you're interrupting the vlog. Get out of here. Go. Mm, that was good. So, oh. <laughs> she can't have that, can she? Yes, she can. She can? Mishka. <laughs> Alright, guys, so I feel great. I feel high energy. Um, I feel good. I feel like healthy. I don't feel as bloated anymore with plant-based diet. Um, after like a heavy steak meal or a burger, you, you kind of feel tired. I don't really get that when I eat food with the, the plant diet. I feel really good. Energy is consistent throughout the day. I was doing two coffees a day, one in the morning, one halfway through the day. Don't do that anymore. I just do one in the morning now. Steffi, you do just one, right? I always do just one, yeah. I yeah. mean, sometimes when I go to school, I do two, but... How many cops do you do, bud? It's very rare. I think Aiden does like five because he's always like... Meh. Aiden is on another level. But, yeah, I do like... I do one. I do sometimes one. two. Juggle it. Um, we gotta rinse them. Can you oh, rinse them? Well, let me juggle it. Alright guys, here we go. Formula One drivers, they juggle, you know, for reaction time. So if I can juggle, I have good reaction. Go. Oh, I did it, man. I got it, look, ready? Ah! Good. A new skill. Circus the leg. Here, Jonathan's coming for you. Woo! But, yeah, overall, I feel really good. Steffi? I feel really good. I think it's helped a lot. Um, you just have to make sure you get your protein and your... Fiber, um, lots of fruits and veggies. Yeah, like, your vi take your vitamins. Um, oh yeah, that's one thing you need, uh, B12. B12 is not in any plant product, so you need that. I'm not a health expert, but do your research, so don't yeah. get mad at us yeah, for- Yeah, don't, don't come at us for- If your, your fingers start falling off or whatever, you're not getting the right protein. No, but that, that is one thing that I, I was kind of scared at. Because yeah, when we first started the diet, uh, my fingertips, it was kind of weird. The skin was peeling off. The skin was peeling off. It was weird. But that, it ended up being, I think, the B12, or just not enough food, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know because then I started getting it too, but yeah. I think it was just like a lack of something, but now we're fine. We're balanced out. We're good to go. Yeah, so just make sure you do your research and you take the right vitamins and supplements that you need for this kind of diet. Like, you know. Talk to your doctor. Talk to your doctor. I think. We didn't talk to our doctor, but. Google. Talk to Google. We did, we did our research online and we're just going based on what we, you know. If you feel good, that's all that really matters. Oh, and another thing I wanted to mention too, the the... The groceries have been less expensive. I feel like we're spending less money on food, which is always cool to save money, you know, wherever you can. So with food, like with meat, you're spending about like 250 a week with, yeah. And with uh, plants, we're doing about like 200. Well, I think this last time we went, it was like 180. 180, so less than 200 bucks. Pretty good, and we're three people in the household. We got Steffi, me, mommy, she's doing her Zoom meeting, and then we got this guy. This guy eats $180 a month, I swear to God. Okay, guys, so there's no excuse in being healthy, to be honest, because- The microwave. This meal takes literally no time. Okay, so 6.58. Um, You're gonna make it right now? You're gonna start it? You're gonna warm up the rice now? Yeah. Okay. Because, don't, why are you questioning me? I'm the one who, 
And our freaking thing sucks. Our microwave, you have to like hold it. Can you hold it for me while I yeah. do some other? You have to put your hand here like this. Um, the inspector didn't catch that when we moved in over here. We're gonna put our new pan to use. Oh, home decor pan. It's honestly the best pan ever and nothing sticks to yeah, it. If you missed that, go check out the last vlog. Go check out the vlog. So yeah, this is like healthy and easy. Well, healthy, kind of. Healthier than other meals, I'm sure, but. Yeah, I wonder how many calories. I've been waiting for this, yeah. It's been up on my mind. Though it's hard to resist. Feeling like one of a kind. Oh, no. And a hack if you're having a party or something and you're making these like look pretty, um, cut this, get rid of obviously the center piece, and then you have this. So then you stuff them and you can put this back in on like this and then bake it um, so it'll look prettier. But I just like to put it right there and then we just eat it cooked. Raw, raw dog. No, we eat it cooked because it's going to go in the oven. So. But the, oh, the, beef. the meatless beef is actually getting heated up. I like to heat it up on the pan prior to put it in, put it in, putting it in the oven just so it can actually, I mean, this doesn't really need to be cooked like that, but if you're doing it with real meat or something, I don't know. I just prefer to do it this way. Yeah, this is the same in, uh, formula for the real meat, right? If, uh, we have none. I don't know. I think some people, people. I think, I think some people actually, uh, like bake it with the raw meat. Mm -hmm. So you put that mixed in. I like to do it this way personally to do the sauce here and, um, give it flavor while it's on the pan. And then I put more sauce when I put it in the bell pepper too, but I personally like to do it this way, and then while it's here, I also season it. So really, what are you I gonna put in? Are we doing sweet potato fries or no? It's up to you. Okay. I will you. add um, some of the garlic salt. All right, it's recording. I feel like with all foods, like whether you're vegan, not vegan, vegetarian, meat, meat whatever. Seasoning is key for everything. Oh yeah. So, there you go. Just like you can have, you know, a piece of chicken that tastes not like nothing. And our, this kind of food. And our oven's weird. It's like, there's no gas. It's like bars. <laughs> it's weird. Yeah. So this is about done. I just kind of do this here and then I turn it off. Okay. I'm going to finish um, with the bell peppers. I'm almost done. Now what I'm gonna do is, I don't know, I clean as I go. But I like to, hold on, don't, don't film me yet. That's something I don't do, film as, or film. Clean as you go? <laughs> clean as I go. Jonathan doesn't, and he leaves a mess. And it's just like, it's easier when you clean up as you go, because then you don't have as much to clean up when you're done. Or at least it doesn't feel like a burden. Maybe I'll I'll film myself to, tomorrow night cooking. I'll have your mom film me. Yeah. So then I like to just stuff them. Um, oh, look at that. That's the way I do it. Just put because we have a lot of bell peppers. I'm gonna not fill them up to the top just yet. I'm gonna first just kind of fill up as much, but leaving a little gap. We want to make sure all the bell peppers have stuffing. You know? I know. <laughs> I know you know. Look at that, guys. That looks delicious. Mm. And it smells really good. If you guys could smell. Mm. Ah, it smells good. It actually smells like real meat. It's weird. It does, and it kind of tastes like real meat. It's a little freaky. Alright, so now that we've stuffed Chanel! Cayete! Now that we've stuffed all of them, then I kind of go back and just um, fill them up. 
Yeah, these are huge. These are pretty filling too. Yeah, they are. Like you're pretty, you're good with one. I like to make multiples. Then you can, it's kind of like a meal prep. You can have them for lunch, for whatever. If you like cooking dinner for, you know, more people. And this is such an inexpensive dinner. Like how much are bell peppers? Let's just say five bucks, five bucks with me. I mean, we're cooking for three people, so probably about like 20 bucks, right? But, I mean, technically, like, a lot of people don't eat this much. Yeah. Like, my mom doesn't eat two, and I don't eat two. And you only do if they're small. Yeah, so probably like three bucks each, right? Yeah, roughly. So then what I, go, what I do is I go in with a clean spoon. A clean because, one? Yeah, because really? you're going to go in like this. So you obviously don't want to contaminate. Especially if you're cooking with me, you don't want to. That's smart, yeah. So you do that, you top it off. This. Especially for us, because this will be for pasta another night. So, just don't want to mix, you know, foods. You're so professional, babe. All right, so we do Where'd that. Where'd you get your degree? Mexico? For my dad. <laughs> And then we top it off with cheese. So this is my favorite part. How cheesy do you want it? That's the question. Well, I got Orange Theory tomorrow. And so not maybe, very cheesy. Maybe light cheese. <laughs> <laughs> nah, no, cheese me up. I'm starving. I honestly like to put a lot of cheese. This is kind of like, it tastes so good Look when it that. melts. I swear, this is like a professional gourmet meal. This is why we don't eat out a lot. We make yeah, we really don't. We don't don't eat out a lot. I like cooking. Yeah. I like okay. watching you cook too. So that's really it guys. And then we just pop it in the oven for 20 minutes. So 20 minutes in the oven for 400 degrees. Uh, you can same watch with the, them sometimes. Yeah, you can yeah, same with the sweet potato fries too. It's like 20 the minutes. Oven. Yep. Ready? Fire in the hole. <laughs> That's a, that's a close call right there. All right, so we'll leave them there. See you in 20, 20 minutes. minutes. It's 712. We started at 658. So 712. Half hour. half hour. That's not half hour. That's almost like 10 minutes of prep time, roughly, like 15 minutes of prep time. And then 20 minutes to cook. You have 20 minutes to do whatever you want, and then just eat. Let's go party. Come in, boys and girls. We are not ready. Are we ready? Yeah, it's ready. Woo -wee. Woo -woo -woo. I mean, it depends on how you like your bell peppers. I personally like them to still be a little crunchy, harder. Yeah, I don't like them soft. Wow. So it just depends on what you want with that. The sweet potato fries need more time, so we're gonna switch them to the bottom rack. All right. So um, Aiden is my date tonight. <laughs> How you doing, bud? So, thoughts, Debbie? How does it taste? I love them. They're like my favorite. All right, let me get my reaction, guys. Oh, look at that. It's split. Split. And we're gonna go split down the middle. Whoa! All right, I gotta do the test. You got a small one. Now I'm gonna be the test of this. Is it hot? Mm -mm. Like it's hot, but it's not like. Mmm. Mmm. You made this? <laughs> so good. Mmm. All right, guys, thanks so much for watching. The Goldens are out. Hope you enjoyed this video of a plant-based diet we're trying out. If you try the, if you go to Trader Joe's and you get the beefless ground beef, let us know how you like it because that's my favorite meat. Comment down below if you tried this diet or want to try the recipe. We'll link everything in the description below. And we'll see you on the next video. The Goldens are out. Bye. Bye. <laughs>